Welcome to Tool Time at Kitchen Conservatory. Roasted red bell pepper is a wonderful ingredient to add to all kinds of foods. I love putting just strips of roasted pepper on salads, for instance, and certainly they can are an essential ingredient in so many recipes like paella. So how do you roast a pepper? First I have a red bell pepper, it's a sweet pepper, it's not a hot pepper, and I have it on a gas burner, directly on the burner. I want to get it completely and totally burnt, charred, all the way around. I'm just going to let it sit there and do it. If you don't have a gas burner, you can do it on a grill, or you can do it under the broiler. If you do it under the broiler, it's almost easier to cut the pepper in half, scoop out the seeds, and put it skin side up on the on the rack closest to the broiler and cook it till it's completely and totally burnt. Then, either way, whether you do it this way or on the grill or on the broiler, what you do afterwards is that you have to steam it so that the pepper is, uh, the skin releases easily. And what I use is just a bowl with a little plastic wrap on top, any kind of lid on top, and I put the pepper, after it's completely burnt, underneath uh, there, and then I'm able to, um, the steam effect will re release the skin and make it very easy to peel. So the reason I'm roasting this pepper today is because I'm going to make pimento. And I know you can buy a little jar of chopped up pimento, but what is it? It's roasted red bell pepper and how much better when it's done freshly. Well, look at this burnt charred pepper. It's the one thing you're allowed to burn in the kitchen. So I slide it in the bowl, cover it, and let it sit until it's cool and then the skin comes off very easily. Thank mm -hmm. you.